happy Thursday. I hope that you are all set and ready to go, ready to get your schoolwork started. Remember, we're not on vacation. I repeat, we are not on vacation, not yet. We have four more weeks of school left. So we're going to use these four weeks to sharpen up our skills and to uh, learn new letters, new words. And we are going to uh, get started by continuing with the letter X. So before we get started on letter X though, we're going to be doing some listening exercises. And today we're going to be adding sounds and deleting sounds. So I know that that's a kind of a, a, a hard concept for some of us, but I want you to really pay attention to the sounds you hear and add the sounds and take away sounds, okay? So for example, if I have the word ed, say ed. Now add er to ed at the beginning. Red, that's your new word, good. Now I have each, say each. Now add er at the beginning of each. What's my new word? Reach, good. All right, if I have at and I add er, I know a lot of er at the beginning, er at the beginning of at. What's my new word? Rat, good. Now if I have lock, say lock. Now add b at the beginning of luck. What's my new word? Block. Good. All right. So now we're going here. I'm going to give you some more. We have rain. Say rain. Rain. Now add t, t to the beginning of rain. Terrain. Good. That's now we have wing. Say wing. Now add s at the beginning of wing. What's my new word? Swing. Good. All right, now we're going to delete sounds, which means we're gonna take away sounds. So my word is twig. Say twig. Now take away the t in twig. What's my new word? Wig. Good. Now I have clock. Say clock. Now take away the k. What's my new word? Lock. Good. If I have stop, say stop. Now what if I take away the s? What's my new word? Top. Good. Rice. Take away the er. What do you have? Ice. Good. If I have the word fear, say fear, and I take away the f. What's my new word? Ear. Good. If I have trip, Say trip, trip. If I take away the t sound, what's my new word? Rip, good. Okay, so I know like I said that that's not the easiest thing to accomplish and I know that it's not the easiest thing to hear, uh, but those are important uh, skills that you need to have. So parents, if you wanna continue with things like that, you can give them some easy words and just have them take away sounds and see what, sound, what word they come up with. All right. So here we go with our letter of the week, which is X. So we have the name of the card is box. The sound of the card is X, the way we spell it, X. Name of the card is box. Sound of the card is X, the way we spell it, X. Name of the card is a uh, box. Sound of the card is X, the way we spell it, X. Good. And some of you sent me in some uh, more uh, pictures or more words that end in X. So um, as you will see, huh, what did Miss Hernandez do right there? Yes, I put a picture in there because my little friend in the blue group, I cannot draw him as much as I tried. <laughs> All right, so here we go. We have uh, the sound X for box, fox, six, fix, X ray, ox, wax, flex, and rex. All right, and this is rex from one of our favorite movies. If you know what movie he's from, send it to me on Class Dojo. All right, here we go. Let's see, uh, we are going to do some letters, and today we have a lot of letters, oops. And um, so, I, you guys know my struggle, I always will try to get this in the middle, but then I can't see you. So here we go, we have Letter here. Oh my goodness, this board. Okay. 
Here we go. Letter X. Letter T. Letter P. Letter X. Letter E. Letter X. Letter X. Letter X. I'm sorry. Did I just say letter X? Letter H. Letter H. Letter X. Letter X. Letter name X. Letter O. Letter X. Letter W. Letter D. Letter Y. Letter X. Letter R. Letter X. Letter C. Letter O. Oh, wait. Letter X. Letter C. Letter N. Letter X. Letter V. Sound. X. Sound. T. Sound. P. Sound. X. Sound. E. Sound. H. Sound. X. Sound. X. Sound. A. Sound. A. Sound. X. Sound. W. Sound. D. Sound. Y. Sound. X. Sound. R. Sound. X. Sound. K. Sound. N. Sound. X. Sound. V. So remember, like always, today's Thursday. I'm not sounding these words out for you. So think. Word. Max. Good. Think. Word. Pox. Good. Think. Word. Fix. Good. Think. Word. Tax. Good. Think. Word. Box. Good. Think. Word. Mix. Very good. All right. So parents, if your child is not doing that yet, make sure that you are practicing those sounding out they need to if they've already had ample practice for three days by this point these are words they've already seen and they should know how to sound out these are letters and words and sounds that they've seen since the beginning of the year so they need to be able to start blending those in their head and not be p ox it's good if they're doing that that's fabulous but we should be working toward that whole word reading now okay all right, here we go. So um, let's move on to your high frequency words for today. Here, H E R E, here, and A N D, and what, W H A T, what, of, O F, my, M Y, T, a uh, two, T O. Good. All right, you're going to need those words to. Uh, write your sentence today. Now, um, <clears throat> let's move on to uh, the tiny seed. So in the tiny seed, we have talked about the, the main character, which is the tiny seed, the setting, which is the great outdoors. The problem, though, was a little difficult to pull out, but it's really that she keeps landing in places that is that are not great for the seed to grow, right? That's what keeps happening. And so she, so what and so the solution to the story is that at the end of the story, it finally lands somewhere where it grows. It's able to grow and and be fruitful, right? So that is the solution. So I want you to draw me a, a picture of that today and send it to me. I would really appreciate it. All right, guys, so before we um, finish here, we're going to, I'm going to be giving you words, and you're going to be, and some of you yesterday, you were trying to record yourself, and Class Dojo does not allow you to upload videos for some reason, which made me kind of, I was kind of sad, because I was looking forward to seeing, to seeing you guys say these sounds, these words and sound, uh, these, these rhyming words to me, but it's okay if you just draw them out, parents, um, uh, make sure you're helping them or guiding them through it. So here we go. So we have sub. Give me two words that rhyme with sub. Okay. And two words that rhyme with bin. Okay. So make sure you are doing that. And if you can't write it, draw me a picture. I love drawings. They're my favorite. All right, guys. So that's it for today. I love you. I will see you on Monday because remember today's Thursday and I don't post tomorrow. So you have a great weekend. I love you. Bye.